In 2016, our sovereignty was violated by a foreign power which found a way to interfere in our democratic process. We faced an attack of a new kind. The Russians hacked democracy. I've been trying for years to figure out what happened. If the U.S. system depends on trust in democratic institutions, who benefits if Americans lose that trust? Are we doing everything we can to make sure that Americans will decide who is running this country? In 2016, it was a three-ring circus of election meddling. Russian trolls had been busy making mischief on the internet. They were using fake accounts, fake organizations, and finally, fake local media. Russian intelligence hacking the DNC. They were not hacking the Trump campaign. In the alleged collusion. Let's instead use the word seduction. You have Russia saying, we want to help you. And you have Don Jr. saying, love it. Of course Russians prefer Trump, because Trump said that he preferred Russians. Russia was not pro-Trump. They were anti-America. <laughs> Russian interference only worked because America was a vulnerable target. The trolls were designing conflict online. They're not injecting anything that wasn't already there. They were getting direction about how to target social media from people in the Trump orbit. These allegations are just absolutely preposterous. Everyone wants to create a huge conspiracy. Give me a break. It was all Bullshit. For some politicians, in Russia and America, chaos isn't something to fear. It's just part of the game. It doesn't matter how you play or who you play with. As long as you wind up on top, who cares if the whole motherfucking system burns to the ground? Is Russia attempting to influence the 2020 election? Вы секрету сам скажу. Да, обязательно будем это делать.